All right, ladies and gentlemen. Top sail beach. Here we come. There's a tram that goes to the beach. Maybe I can make it. Hold on. Let's see. Instead of walking, this will save some time. Hold on. How's this work? Just hop over it? Okay. Oh, I didn't know. I thought you may have reserved it or something. Thanks, buddy. Let's sit on this side, I guess. I was going to walk it, but why not? Yeah, I didn't know how far it was, so I figured to take advantage of it. You said a half, a half mile, so I mean, maybe I'll walk. I'll take this there since it was here conveniently, and, uh, and I'll walk it back. Thank you, brother. Oh, this is so cool they have this guys. Game stop to 9 a.m. So I guess that's yeah. what this is. And it runs every half hour. Oh, cool. Little station here. Awesome. And uh, our parking spot is really close to this, our, uh, our campsite. You saw literally 50 steps. Yeah. It's like the rides at Disney World. They just want to make sure everybody's secure. Maybe he's waiting for more people. Uh -huh. Here we go. Hold on to your hats. Who needs Disney World? We got trams, ladies and gentlemen. So I was just, I was talking to one of the rangers, and uh, he told me that the natural flora and fauna here is something to really behold. So we'll uh, we'll get a look at it here on the way to the beach. These people are making more. Morning. Morning. I know I'm like a broken record, but just imagine the barefoot mailman down by where I live. Back in the day, this is what it all looked like. To get to the beach, they had to get through this stuff. I mean, can you just imagine? This really shows you what they had to deal with. These guys carried machetes with them. Constant reminder of who this channel is named for. Big wave. Now, why does that sound familiar? We're here. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it. This is a, a nice boardwalk bridge that takes you over these dunes and to the shoreline. Look at these dunes, guys. Just one after another. This is incredible. So once again, you may be wondering why I didn't take the e-bike here. Um, and it makes sense that you don't see anybody here with bikes. They left them over there at the rack. It's because the sand up here is uh, not really conducive to riding an e-bike on, in my opinion. It's so powdery, it's so loose and beautiful and wonderful. This is the sand you wanna just walk on. Now look at the emerald green color of the ocean as I approach. views guys the views life ladies and gentlemen is good but it's that much better 
in Florida. Let's go barefoot. Guys, the views here and the sand, this just powdery sand, it's literally like Johnson's baby powder. I mean, look at it. So that down there to the west of me, I'm pretty sure, is Destin. And we're going to go check that out here in a couple hours. Spend a good part of the day there. And then, that's right, we're going to camp there. You asked for Florida, you got Florida. In a pink neon shirt. Order yours today. Link's in the description. Guys, look at the stingray. Look at the stingray. You see the stingray? Look at him. Hello. They don't really sting, do they? I'm gonna get in this ocean. Didn't really bring a towel with me other than that little foot, foot towel. That's my uh, dead cat drying out. My dead cat drowned. Um, so I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna go in. Here we go. Here goes nothing. I didn't realize exactly how pink that shirt is. Maybe that's what attracted the, uh, the raid until it was off of me. I, I'm telling you right now, I absolutely love it. I, I think it's my favorite shirt. Don't laugh at my skivvies. This beautiful ensemble doubles as underwear. All right, guys, help me keep an eye out for these stingrays, sea rays, manta rays. Uh-oh, that's something swimming away over there. What is that? I thought it was seaweed, it's not. It's swimming. It's got legs, or fins, or gills, or all three. Looks like a stonefish. I don't want to be stepping on one of those. I think it was maybe a puffer fish. Get out of here, puffer fish. Go puff somewhere else, will you? Go puff in your own neighborhood. Oh, wait a second. This is your neighborhood. I'm in the ocean. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's small, but it's still... I'm on his territory. I'm in his turf, and I'm getting away from my stuff. So, you know what? For all the talk about they have no waves, you know, on the Gulf Coast, they got some little waves here. I mean, you certainly couldn't surf these. Guys, this is it for me. I'm not going any deeper than this right here. I'm just, I'm just up off my knees. And that's gonna work for me. Ready? Here goes nothing. Ah, uh, don't let my stuff get wet. By the way, it just occurred to me, why am I the only one in the ocean? I'm the only one. Not a great sign. It reminds me of that scene in Jaws, remember? When the mayor was walking around the beach going, come on, how come you're not in the water? Get in the water. Famous last words. All right, I'm gonna at least dunk on you. Ready? Here goes nothing. Oh. oh, it's beautiful. Oh, it's so lovely. Stay away from me, sharks. Stay away from me, sharks. Where's my shark repellent? And stingray repellent. And stonefish repellent. And anything that has teeth repellent. Could it be a wave? This is beautiful, guys. Some of you have reached out to me that live in this area. Um, and thank you for doing that. You've been so kind and gracious with information and um, almost apologetic. Some of you have been apologetic about, oh, this isn't really what our weather is like. And this isn't really what our... Our, our ocean looks like, our, you know, the Gulf of Mexico here. It's so much nicer if you come when it's nice. You know what, guys? Let me tell you something. This is nice. I can tell. I can tell. It's, it's, it's pretty cloudy and overcast. But I like it. And you can still get a, a sense of how green this water is. Part of what lights up the ocean is 
when it's sunny and, and the reflections that work upon the water and the depths of the of the ocean and uh, so when it's cloudy when there's not as much Sun of course it only makes sense that you're not gonna get that same color those those vibrant colors and hues that come out so no apologies necessary this is absolutely beautiful and thank you time to make tracks let's go check out Destin it's right there our destiny lies in Destin I hate to leave this but we uh we got more ground to cover so let's be on our way before we do that let's just walk back here and take a look at these dunes you guys are gonna wreck me in the comments for this bathing suit have at it all right keep your shirts on we're not going on the dunes but we're gonna look at them we're gonna look at them and appreciate nature's wonder and what the coasts of America once looked like from sea to shining sea. Now where did I park my sandals? Oh yeah, they're down there. They got everything figured out here. You could take your selfies here. Topsail Hill Preserve State Park. Shortened by barefoot for top to topsail. It's got 3.25 miles of white sand beach along the Gulf of Mexico. It's extremely important to many designated species like nesting turtles and shorebirds. Wow, they got loggerheads and greens, among others. All right, turtles, enjoy your beautiful home. Beachfront property, who's better than you? Loggerhead, isn't that a beer? That's the only ones we'll be disturbing. <sighs> Out of this view, walking back. Look at that. Disconnect the shore power and get on out of here. All right, I got my electrical laundry. Let's get out of here. Oh wait, I gotta wash those babies out. By the way, check this out. What is that thing? What is that? I thought it was a mushroom last night. I'm not so sure. Anyway, that won't be going in tonight's soup. I can promise you that. All disconnected, all packed up and ready to go. Let's be on our way. I dropped my little Easter egg hints in the Instagrams, and here we are. We've reached Destin, one of the places that I was most excited about visiting. I guess this is downtown Destin here. You can pick up I-10 right there, which is convenient. This is 98 that I'm still on. You got all your shops and restaurants, and gas stations and banks and Ruby Slipper, ice cream shop. Oh, look at that place, Alvin's Island. And I would imagine that these condos, hotels, whatever they are, this is 30A I'm on, the A1A of the Emerald Coast. Touristy here. 
There's another Alvin's Island. They got a few of those. Gilligan Seafood! Gave me a chance to say Gilligan in this vlog. I think this is where I'm going. Use the left lane to make a U-turn, then turn right. The old Harbor Walk Village. I don't know if these are condos or that's a hotel, but it's beautiful. I hope I got enough room to make a U-turn in this monstrosity. Here goes nothing. Oh, slow down. Yet I didn't. Check that out. Double decker tour bus. And uh it's got like mannequins in it, and I thought they were real people. Ten dollar parking pay on exit. It's a bargain. Wow. This is a busy place for a Monday morning. Do not enter, do not enter, do not enter. All right, guys, let me park this rig and save my battery. I'll see you on that giant tower over there, whatever that is. I think we're going to go live. Yeah, that thing, look at that thing. Holy cow. Probably get some good signal up there. Uh, entrance here to Harbor Walk Village in Destin. And I'm getting ready to go live, as you can see. So I'm going to show all this on the live stream. But I wanted to just put a little intro here on the vlog to let you know that I'm live streaming from here and I'm gonna try that right there is a zip line I've never been on one and I don't know if they'll let me hold the camera for it doesn't look like it's a very long um, journey across this little village they have here but go watch the live stream to find out anyway going down there here we go Wow, very cool guys, very cool, very Disney-esque. You got the boats right here on the harbor. This is fantastic. Okay, just a little taste of it. Good thing is, showing good signal, so let's have a good live stream. Over and out. Ooh, cannon stone thunder, there's nothing to plunder. pleasure of meeting the band. Here we go. The Aces in person. Thank What's your name? Jerick. Jerick. That's a good you had to make it hard on me, didn't you? And your name? <laughs> Lincoln. 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 Like Lincoln, Nebraska, like Abraham Lincoln. Okay, Jerick and Lincoln. I love it. With names like that, these guys are going places. So Thank tell me a little bit about your story. You guys came here from, from Texas? Right out of high school we his, his older brother actually lived down here a year before, the year prior. He's like, yeah, y'all need to come move out? Like, instantly we already had jobs lined up. Running beach chairs, building beach chairs. I, I build the beach chairs that you see. He runs them. We're just trying to pursue a dream of playing music, trying to get our name out there right now. And, uh, well, I think uh, you guys are going places. I'm not just saying that. I have a good ear for it when I hear it. Um, I can just tell. What places are you playing? We play at the Sandbar. It's okay. like the Silver Shells Beach Sport and Resolve. Okay. Uh, it's a little bar out there next to the beach. And then we've been playing here every Monday. What's your goal? Become famous. Become yeah. famous, yeah. Have, make this a living. Why not? You can do it. Music is a living. That's the, that's the dream. If you put your minds to it, you have the talent. Yes, sir. You just got to put in the hard work. Yes. That's what it's all about. And never give up on your dream. Mm -hmm. I can relate to that. I mean, I've got this thing going. That's awesome. You know, you get people that believe in you, you get people behind you, yeah. and um, it can really make it happen. So, you guys, best of luck with everything, Thank and uh, thanks for stopping by and chatting with us. And we're, how do people find you? The, uh, you guys have um, a website or something? We have we have an Instagram. It's what? we don't even know our own. V underscore Aces Official. There it is, guys. Look these guys up, support them, and give them all the love they deserve. Thank you. Well, thanks, guys. Nice Thank meeting you. Sure you. Best of luck. All right. There go my, my two friends. Sherrick and Lincoln, otherwise known as Aces. Oh, I'm a
later, guys. Later. It was a pleasure meeting you. Same here. We'll be in touch. Thank you. Aces, ladies and gentlemen. And they are the aces. There's lots of dudes Look, you could see the bottom. These fish are jumping over here, so I want to see what's chasing them all. Holy cow, look at them all. Jumping like crazy. Something's chasing them. That looks like my boat. The barefoot barnacle. The barefoot barnacle. I love it. Let's go out for an adventure on the barefoot barnacle. That egret right there. That's a big one. Oh, we got a treasure chest. We got a treasure chest with a beer keg. Talk about a metaphor. Beer, the ultimate treasure. Discover yours today. Good spot for a selfie. Dude, I hope you don't mind, but I was just telling everybody what a genius that you are. Oh, yeah, yeah tr a, tr a treasure chest. It's our treasure chest. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's the treasure right there. Who came up with that idea? You know, it just went with the pirate ship, right? Oh, it's a pirate ship. Is this your boat? Uh, no, sir. Just a uh, captain of the vessel. Are you a captain? Well, don't say just. That's the most important job here. Yeah, there you go. Uh, the Daniel Webster Clements, AJ's Destin, Florida. Come right along. Fantastic. Can I? Step yeah. aboard and just yes, take sir. a look. Yeah, absolutely. I appreciate yeah. that. Can you can you give me a little nickel tour here? Oh uh, yeah, you know, oh, right here. I love know, to show I'm these. Sorry, it's a charter vessel, so yeah, no, no, you know, it is a little sloppy right now. No, just trust me. Hey, charters. dude, I'm living in an RV right now. Yeah. Okay, I know all about sloppy. Don't worry about it. Yeah, so it's because you know, big part of the reason is you. It's hard to put stuff away because you don't have that much room for it. Well, you know, well this vessel, we got plenty of storage. It's just run a daily with multiple passengers absolutely no I totally get it but yeah, so that's part of the fun our aft cabin and then our forward cabin our truck our trusty lock systems you know I love the smell is that is that the smell of wood that I smell yeah so this boat is all pine it's built pine. out of a uh, yellow pine my goodness, so that's it right there. Look at that. 1997. You know, it's built after 1800s Biloxi Gaff Rig schooner. Biloxi, Mississippi. Yeah, so this was, you know, one of them. It's a southern boat. Used to haul a bunch of freight. Man, that's maybe a bunch of cargo. So what do we have? The, what do we have down there? Is, it, are the, is that people can sleep down there? Are those rooms? Yeah, what are, so we could do up to charter uh, 22 passengers overnight. 52 passengers during the day and um, you know right now we keep it about 35 just to keep it comfortable but we legally could do it where do you guys go uh, just right here in the Destin Harbor in the East Pass and into the Gulf of Mexico and then we also like to sail up in Chaltahatchee Bay tell me a little bit about the geography here because I'm from the southeast coast of Florida so this is all new to me is this right here Crab Island Southeast, like, um, well, I'm born and raised down in Fort Pierce. Where are you from? Oh, really? I'm from Boca Raton. Yeah, so I'm definitely familiar with all down south. Oh, so cool. Bunch of family down there. Oh, Shout awesome. Out. Yeah, there you go. What am I looking at right here? Um, as far as this is a Noriego Point, it's just some sand dunes. You know, all this used to be sand dunes before these condos and stuff were here. Really? So, you know, one thing we have is called the Destin Dome. As you can see, it's like downpouring north of us, all around us, and then we just have some. Some, sun, some sunshine poking through. Oh, uh, so right here, this is the harbor. Mm -hmm. And then we have our pass that goes out in the Gulf. So if we want to go in the Gulf, you know, we'll go through the pass. And then if not, we'll go under here, William T. Marler Bridge, and we'll head north into Chaltahatchee Bay, which is part of what's called the Intracoastal. 
Oh, you have an intracoastal on this side too, like yes, we do sir. on the other side. Yes, sir. So you could actually take this all the way to Texas. Um, knowing what you do about this area, if you had one day to spend here, 24 hours, what should they not miss before they leave? Well, I guess we have our local pot of dolphins. Everybody loves the dolphins, right? Yeah, dolphins. So, you know, dolphins are, they're not guaranteed, but they're, they're usually hanging out here all the time. Really? And I'm a person that likes to be on the water. So yeah. I would say come out on a boat, come sailing. Good idea. Watch the Clements, the sailboat here at AJ's. Awesome. And, uh, it's a good time. So awesome. Come on out. Thank you. What was your name, sir? Jonathan Mills. Jonathan Mills, Barefoot Vlogger. Yeah, so nice to meet you. Thank yeah. you, my friend. Good luck out This is there. awesome. And the forward cabin too. You can let me come down here. Look at this. There, she got these portal windows. Look at these things. Are they square? I don't know. What do you call these windows? Are these still portal windows? Yes, sir. They are. Look at that. With a great view. It reminds me of Jaws. The Orca, guys. This is the Orca. I'm on it right now. You're going to need a bigger boat. Look at this. This is all original, guys. This is original stuff here. Look at this. I don't even know what that is. It's a pipe, but it's fantastic. And uh, look at that. Unbelievable. Wow, thank you, man. Tonight, is it when you just broke around vlogging by yourself? Destin Dome. Here it is. Right on schedule. In the afternoon. Time to make tracks, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go home. Henderson Beach State Park, 17 triple zero Emerald Coast Parkway. Let's go. What's up, brother? Hello, sir. How are you? Good. What's the damage? Ten dollars. Ten dollars? Why, that's an outrage. You parked here? I wouldn't pay that if I was you. Yeah, I was parked there. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I was. I was parked there. Okay. Yeah. Ten dollars. Oh. Oh, okay. I didn't. I met my friends here, leaving. These guys are so nice. It's one's from Bosnia, the other one's from Romania. Really nice gentlemen. Hello. Hello, guys. What uh? What do you guys think of this place, Harbor Walk? It's pretty good, huh? A lot of fun. Yeah. What's your favorite thing to do? Working. Working. I love it. They're working. They're hard, young, working men. So, thank you for all you guys do. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you too. Those guys were cool. All right. We're going to Henderson State Park. Let's go. In the rain. All right, 
seen them everywhere. Let's go check it out. There was like three of them within two blocks. Just a little detour. I gotta see what this place is all about. Here we go. Alvin's Island Outlet Store. So there was a movie years ago. It starred Ashley Judd. It's one of her first movies. It might have been her first movie. I think it was called Ruby by the Sea or something like that. It was about a girl that uh, picks up and moves away from someplace like the Midwest. And she comes down to Florida and she ends up not far from here. Actually, Panama City Beach. And uh, she gets a job working in a place like this. Let's go see if we can find her. Shirts, hats, sunglasses, bathing suits, sun visors, Panama Jack hats that say Destin, Florida, short shorts, who wears short shorts, bags. Hey, you know what I mean? It's nice to get something when you come down here and, or up here in my case. And uh, you want a little memorable token from your trip. So they do have some nice stuff here. Florida wouldn't be complete without those stickers. No comment. I don't do politics. I'll leave that to you guys. That pineapple one gets my vote. Can't get these here though. Only on the Barefoot Blogger Network website. Links in the description, by the way. All right, guys. Anyway, when you're Dustin, shop till you drop at Alvin's. You got the little uh, boogie boards. I gotta take a selfie. I gotta take a selfie. Do I have the camera? This was fun. I mean, um, truth be told, it's kind of like a poor man's Ron John search shop, but nonetheless, they got something for everyone, including a lifeguard chair that we just have to sit in. And it's parked right in front of my parking spot. Oh, of course it's wet. But that's okay. It's all part of the experience. Thanks, Albans. I'm watching traffic. On my watch, this would be the first time that someone drowned in traffic. Onward and upward. All right, you guys want to see a Florida thing? Alabama plate right there. Alabama plate right there. California, here I come, wait right there. I had three cars in front of me. Not one of them was from California. Two Alabamas and one California. When I say California, I meant Florida. Then the destination is on your left. In 800 feet, the destination is on your left. 17000 Emerald Coast Parkway. America's best state parks. We've said that a few times in the last few days. There you go, welcome to Henderson Beach State Park. That's where we are, the real Florida, baby. 
The destination is on your left. All right, we got. Yeah, yeah, Emerald yeah. Coast we know. Parkway. Okay, hold on. Let me turn you off. All right, you can be quiet now. Shh, quiet. Now we're in a park. Let's make sure we get our room. What's up, my friend? How are you? All right, and yourself? I'm good. I'm the Barefoot Vlogger on YouTube. I hope you don't mind this. It's all part of the experience. Not a problem. Thank you. My name, I appreciate that. My name is Terry, and I have a reservation with you guys, and oh, I'm very excited Terry, about it. We, we have your site at 56. He knows. He knows. Yeah. Yes, sir. If you don't mind, just pull right over there in the front. Come on in. We'll get you checked in. Oh, I come in. So I just put on one yes. of these spots right here. Okay. Yes, sir. I will be right in. Thank you. One, you, you too. You too. Look at this. Special door to door treatment. Actually, I like it better when I don't have to get out of the RV, but they want me to, so here we go. I hope this doesn't mean I'm in trouble. <laughs> All right, let's go. We'll find out. Hey there. Hello. You know, I'm curious. If What if I would have come after hours? Then what I would I have done? I would have been in trouble, huh? We would have just had to treat you. <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> My shirt! Look at this, I'm color coordinated. My shirt's a little brighter though, actually. I'm sorry. Okay. Turn it up. Alright guys. And let's roll off. Okay, I gotta make a left over here. The beach pavilions. Ooh, should we go see that first? Let's go see that first. So this is Henderson State Park. All right, I'm gonna go to this one. Right. These dunes, holy cow. It's like one park after another has bigger dunes than the last one I was at. Helicopters are after us with the searchlights. It's pretty sticky right now. There's no breeze. But it's beautiful. It's the end of the day. And uh, the sky looks like one of those Crayola crayons. Remember the 64 colors they gave you? And there was that gray one that no one used. Well, they should use it because it's beautiful and the sun is kind of peeking out right behind it and uh, this is gorgeous. What was the name of that crayon? Put it in the comments. Wow. I wouldn't mind going into it. I tell you what, if you guys really want to get the best beach experience that you can, going back to the days where they really were unspoiled coastlines, even in places where they are pretty spoiled, go to the state parks that have beaches because they're protected. So you can't build condos here, okay? And you can't spoil them. They, they spoil them the bad spoiled like when you leave food out and it gets spoiled not spoiled like you know showering somebody in golden riches it's the it's the bad spoiled and uh they're unspoiled you have to go down there to get to the condos or in that direction to the hotels and condos so you know these folks are smart they're out here enjoying this even at this time of the day when the sun is uh, challenged by all that cloud cover, it's still putting up a good fight, isn't it? Thank you, Mr. Sun. Mr. Blue Sky. Remember that song, Yellow?
I don't know which side is prettier. Be nice to see the sunset, but I don't think those clouds are cooperating. Let's take a look at the water here in the Gulf of Mexico and look at this jellyfish. Hello, Mr. Jellyfish. Don't sting me. I've been a good boy, don't sting me. I tell you what, the sea life that I'm seeing here is just like, I'm in my, I'm up to my ankles. Before with that stingray, it was like, I was below my kneecaps. I was at my caps. So imagine what's waiting out there. Oh God, the sand, guys, I'll tell you what. You like a foot massage? Every once in a while I get one from Svetlana. Let me tell you right now, come here, put your feet in the water and wiggle them around and the sand, it's so incredible, it, it's, it's got a massage effect. Absolutely awesome. that quiet back there. A little tour of Henderson State Park Beach. Let's go get our spot right now. See where we're at before it gets dark. Maybe we'll even do another live stream. I'd do it. I'm actually getting good signal here, but uh, my battery's dead. Either I got a full battery and there's no signal, or there's signal and I got no battery. Never the twain shall meet. Right. Registered campers only. That's us. Gave me a map too, hold on. Let me break that out just in case. You guys know me with directions by now. Oh, stop rolling around back there. All right, so we gotta basically take this all the way around and then bear right at that fork. Y'all come to a fork in the road. Take it. 60, what are we, 56? So we're going this way. Here we go. Oh, one way. This is the fork. And I almost messed it up. All right. 46. 50. Are you guys getting the hang of this by now? Oh, they're having a nice little dinner. 51. Why is it going down? I can't even see what that was. 53. 54. 55. This must be us right here. 56. So it looks like our people backed in. Where's the power? 56, so uh, my power's on my left side, so, and it looks like, where is it? I don't see it. Well, I certainly don't see it on this side, so it must be on that side. So here we go, I'm gonna back it on in. Back it on in. Yeah, it is over there. This, I like this, this is clean. This is clean living right here. Back it right in. Look at this, guys. Am I getting good at this or what? All right, I'm a kid from Brooklyn, but I was born to do this. Shout, don't hit the picnic table. 
There's my water, there's my power right there. Let's get closer to it. There we go. All right. Just one last thing, guys. As I... Since this is a van life series, I just want to show you. I'm not saying it's the greatest sight in the world, but you know what? It's roomy. It's really roomy. It's really neat. It looks like beachcombers were out here sifting the gravel and making it neat. I mean, look at this. There's no mud. You have these corner borders here to keep everything tidy. All right, my, pa my uh, power and water hookups are right here, so I'm gonna get that in right now. But look how neat this is. This, ladies and gentlemen, is how every campsite should be. I understand, you know, the whole roughing it, you know, um, making it look natural and all that kind of stuff, but it, 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 it'll feel a little too natural when it starts raining, trust me, and you get mud everywhere. All right, let's get this baby going. You guys know how to do this by now, right? First things first, we want 30 amps right there. That's 50, we want 30. Shut it off, make sure everything's off. Grab this bad boy. Throw it in there. Remember what I told you guys? It's right here. Open that up. I like to just clear it a little bit, make sure there's no moisture there. We are dealing with electricity after all. In, twist, and then turn that baby. Easy peasy. I'm multitasking. Fire away. Blue and green light. It's all she wrote. I'm not hooking up the water. I don't need it. I'll find the bathroom around here somewhere. Let's see how far it is. All right, guys. Time to hit the showers. We got our power. We're in like Flynn. I'm in a tune out, guys. Till next time. From spot 56 in Henderson State Park, Destin, Florida. I can't believe you remembered where I was. This is the Barefoot Vlogger saying stay well, stay tuned. Thank you.